Hello, I'm at 32361Nut. It is Wednesday, <clears throat> May 11th, 2022, and I'm going to be doing the uh, interior move-in walkthrough. So the lockbox will be hanging right here from the front door when you come by for move-in. After you get the key out of it, if you could please take it off and store it underneath the kitchen sink for safekeeping, that would be great. A quick note about the property before we get started. So this property has not been cleaned yet at the time of this report, but it will be cleaned before move-in. <clears throat> Also wanted to note down that throughout the property there are going to be a lot of just kind of general wear marks on the trim, windowsills, doors, baseboards. Um, right here on the banners is a good example. As you can see, there's just kind of like some general wear. There's going to be stuff like that kind of throughout the property, but no large damage. Um, looking pretty good. So we're going to start right here in the living room. The uh, door right here, back of the front door right here has a lot of marks on it. Like I just mentioned, the doors will have some marks on them. But the walls in here are looking good, undamaged. There are some paint marks present, but other than that, all looking fine. Windows right here have screens, blinds, and curtains. Windows are looking a slightly older. They are original to the property, so they are showing a little bit of wear and tear. Like I said, there are some paint marks kind of present on the walls in here, but no large damage, no holes or anything like that. So all is looking fine there. Floor in here is looking good. There might be some slight wear marks um, here and there just from use. Specifically kind of right here in the middle, the, uh, the, uh, as you can see, it's a slightly different color than the rest of the floor. So just a little bit of wear and tear, but uh, no problems there. We're going to come on down the hallway now and take a look at the half bathroom next. So half bathroom right here. Walls are unmarked and undamaged, but there are kind of maybe some drywall inconsistencies present. But not a problem. Exhaust fan does work. Toilet, toilet paper holder. Toilet is showing a little bit of wear and tear from age. It's a little bit older, but it is working and operational. Sink looks good. Pedestal's working. We got a towel hook, mirror, lights, all looking fine. No problems there. Back of the door looks good. And the floor in here is, again, maybe showing some slight wear and tear just from age and use, but it is uh, undamaged. All right, next we're gonna come on over to the, uh, to the dining room right here. And I did want to point out in the hallway, again, there are a few paint marks on the walls, but uh, no, uh, no damage or anything, just a few kind of paint marks present. Dining room right here, again, um, unmarked, undamaged walls, all looking fine. Window right here has blinds and a screen. She's definitely showing some wear and tear from age. There's like some old adhesive marks present kind of on the frame. But walls here look good, no problems there. We have a metal cart right here that's provided for use, and there's also uh, the thermostat's gonna be right there on the wall. The floor in here is looking good, unmarked and undamaged again, maybe some very slight wear and tear just from use, but uh, no large damage or anything like that. All right, next we're gonna come on over to the kitchen. So the kitchen walls, again, unmarked and undamaged, but there are a lot of paint marks present, especially kind of over here in the hallway and on the ceiling right there. Um, so definitely a lot of paint marks present. But uh, there is no damage or anything like that. The, uh, the cabinets here are, uh, are showing some pretty heavy wear and tear from age and use. Um, I think they are original to the property, so uh, definitely some wear and tear on the exterior. And uh, there's uh, definitely some marks and scratches and stuff on the interior. But uh, not a problem. They are all working and up, so all looks fine there. <clears throat> Countertops, same thing. This countertop's a little bit newer, so it is unmarked and undamaged. But all these countertops over here, I believe they are, again, original to the property. So they are showing some wear and tear. But no large damage, just kind of some general wear throughout. Right here we kind of have a hook on the wall with some little baskets provided. I took a picture of the pantry and all the closets on my move-in report, so please take a look at that. Uh, note down that the pantry door does kind of rub on the floor a little bit. And we'll take a look at the appliances now. So the fridge is right here. Fridge is unmarked and undamaged, all looking good. Interior here also looks fine. All the drawers are working, all the pockets are working. All looks good there. Same thing with the freezer. All the shelves are up and working. All these little pockets are up and working. And the unit is cooling. So all looks good there. There are kind of some slight paint marks out here on the corner, but no problem there. All looking fine. Dishwasher right here. Again, unmarked and undamaged. All looking good. Inside looks great. No problems there. 
sink, hot water works, garbage disposal works. Again, underneath there is uh, some pretty heavy wear and tear inside the cabinet here, as you can see. So, just wanted to note that down, but it will be staying how it is. So here's the stove. The, uh, the hood works, as you can see. The lights are working. The stove itself is uh, definitely showing some wear and tear from use. Um, there's lots of wear on the stove top burners and on the drip pans, you can see. But they are all working, ready to be used. Same thing with the oven. Definitely some wear and tear on the inside. Uh, but again, the unit has not been cleaned yet, so it will be clean before move in. Uh, but I just wanted to note down what it looked like in case some of that wear does not come up. Floor in here is definitely showing some, uh, some wear and tear from age and use. Mainly over here, kind of in front of the sink and the stove, but uh, no problems. HVAC vent definitely has a lot of marks on it, but no problems there. All looking fine. All right, next we're going to come on over here to the family room. So again, family room. There are a few light marks on the walls in the family room here. Definitely some paint marks present. There's also just kind of some general marks and scratches. Window here has screen, blinds. <clears throat> The back door right here does not have any screens or blinds, but there is a curtain rod provided for use. And uh, these windows right here, again, they are, um, has a screen and blind. Oh, I apologize, I'm sorry, only blinds, no screens. And there is definite wear and tear present uh, on the frame. There's like some old adhesive kind of around the frame. So just wanted to note that down. And also in here is going to be the fireplace. So this is a no burn fireplace. Please do not start any fires in it. If you'd like to light some candles or something like that, that'd be great, but please do not burn anything. Uh, the hearth right here is definitely showing some heavy wear and tear, lots of marks throughout on the hearth and also on the mantle. It looks like it just is wearing very heavily, lots of paint marks present and stuff like that. Lots of mist paint spots. You can see there's some paint on the grill down below. So. Just some paint here and there, just wanted to note that down. And the floor in here, again, showing some wear and tear from age and use. There are a couple scratches present. We got kind of a large one right there and some other light ones right here in front of the fireplace. But uh, no large damage, just some kind of general wear and tear and scratches. All right, that'll be it for part one. We're gonna go ahead and go on upstairs for part two. Thank you very much.